Welcome dear students. Let's learn about solar cooker in this video lecture. The, the uh, device which uh, you are looking at is a solar cooker uh, which is a, a box type solar cooker. Actually there are two kinds of uh, solar cookers. Uh, one is a box type solar cooker and uh, another one is uh, a parabolic um, reflector which has a parabolic reflector. Uh, so a uh, solar cooker is a device which is used to cook food using uh, solar energy and that solar energy is converted into uh, the heat energy uh, which, uh, which we are then utilizing to cook food. And this rectangular uh, box uh, is lined with an insulating, uh, insulating material and that uh, insulating material uh, prevents the uh, heat loss uh, due to conduction, uh, convection or radiation. And uh, within this wooden box is a tightly fitted metallic box. Okay? Uh, it's a tightly fitted me metallic box whose inner surface is painted in black. Uh, the uh, purpose of painting black is that uh, the black body absorbs uh, more heat and it uh, absorbs more radiations as you know as uh, compared to other uh, bodies the top of the box has a glass lid that helps to trap the heat this is a glass lid here it helps to uh, to trap the heat inside the solar cooker okay. uh, when the rays enter this box uh, the the uh, the purpose of this glass is that uh, these uh, that that heat should not escape from the box and uh, and this glass lid helps to trap the uh, trap the heat inside the solar cooker and the upper side of the solar cooker has a plan mirror uh, this is a plan mirror here as you can see uh, this is a reflecting surface also uh, we can call it uh, as reflecting surface uh, so uh, it's fixed uh, uh, it is uh, fixed over it and uh, it can be adjusted at any angle to increase the number of sun rays entering the box. Okay, it can be fixed. It has a screw here. Uh, with the help of that uh, screw, uh, it can be uh, it can be fixed. Uh, we can um, we can put it uh, into any angle here. Uh, so, uh, in in order to cook. Metallic utensils are used, uh, used, and their outer surface are painted black. Uh, the the utensil which which you are using for cooking, you have to uh, paint that uh, utensil uh, black, so that that utensil also absorbs much radiation, um, so that it can heat up very quickly. And uh, within three or four hours, the uh, temperature within the box rises to about uh, 100 degrees centigrade to 140 degrees centigrade okay uh, uh, which is enough for cooking uh, for cooking rice and for cooking uh, dal and, and etc and uh, in case uh, we need to use a solar cooker for uh, grilling and uh, frying we need higher temperature okay for example we have to grill something or we have to fry something we need higher temperature and uh, in uh, in that case, we can replace plan reflectors by uh, um, by spherical reflectors. Okay, this is a plan reflector here. It's a it's a plan mirror. Well, uh, we can also put uh, here a mirror, and uh, this is a plan reflector. And uh, in order to get higher temperature, we need to we need we need spherical uh, reflectors. And uh, that spherical reflectors collect the solar radiations from, from a larger area and uh, concentrate at the principal focus and are able to attain uh, the temperature of, of, of about 180 degree centigrade to 200 degree centigrade. This is the device which, which I am talking about. This is a solar cooker with parabolic reflector. Uh, the uh, rays are coming from the sun, uh, sun and, and are reflected back at one point and that point is, uh, is a principal focus. And uh, in, in this parabolic uh, 
reflector uh, the the collection of solar radiations are are from larger area that means uh, solar radiations are collected from from larger area as you can see here this is a, this is very large area this has got a very large area and uh, uh, within this area we collect the solar radiations and uh, in this manner we are able to attain the temperature of uh, about 180 degrees centigrade to 200 degrees centigrade and by uh, by by um, raising the temperature we can we can grill the food or we can fry the food at 